Time to sniff out Burberry's newest release for men. Initial impression coming up. Hey YouTube fragrance family, thank you for tuning in to this initial impression on Mr. Burberry. Um, beautiful bottle, beautiful presentation. No, this is not a bottle. This is a sample I got when I purchased a whole bunch of designers. So um, this is a fragrance that I've, again, I think I've smelt maybe once. It's a, I don't think I've smelt it. I'm trying to remember. Um, really, if I did, it was really faint. So uh, Mr. Burberry, uh, sexy bottle. I love the bottle, the presentation. I'm surprised I haven't blind bought this sucker. So opening this up, I got a little vial here. So this is going to be good enough for maybe three wearings. Um, I love the atomizer. I love this, these kind of samples. So Mr. Burberry, um, the only real thing that I made uh, some research on this fragrance, the only real thing I know about this fragrance is one of my favorite pet fumes behind this, Francis K. Um, just Burberry fragrances are very much hit or miss in the men's game. Um, I haven't really heard much. Um, I know a lot of fragrance reviewers have tackled this fragrance. Um, I haven't heard much as far as overly positive with this fragrance. It really was lukewarm. Some people are very, they're happy with it, but not very happy. So uh, time to spray this stuff on my skin and I'm gonna let you guys know initial impression again. Keep it tuned in. I'm gonna do a sampling samples on this once I'm uh, done with this stuff. So Mr. Burberry, let's go. Uh, I'm gonna put it, no fragrance there, perfect. I'm gonna do a double shot, triple shot here. Let's see. Very fresh. It almost comes off grassy there. What the hell? I don't think I've heard anybody talk about this fragrance being grassy. No, no, that's grapefruit. <laughs> what the? F <laughs> grapefruit. So, not a good start. Um, just because it's a simple grapefruit is so. Yeah. Hmm. Yeah, grapefruit opening. So your typical designer opening. Uh, yeah, it's. <laughs> do I have to say it? Grapefruit always easy, uplifting. Um, something that is, in almost any designer release mainstream designer release really just doesn't if you smelt one you smelt the other this really doesn't stand out it's very fresh however for retail price for Burberry you're looking at probably what 80 bucks for this bottle um, I would wait till it hits discounters already um, this opening is not telling me much here um, grapefruit opening as you would get from a $20 fragrance and I'm being honest here this opening is not giving me much. It's not even giving me uh, much development as far as what I'm going to be getting in the dry down. Yeah, it's just very fresh. Uh, man, that's that's disappointing. I I don't know why people are really interested in this one. Very pleasant, um, very mainstream. Um, however, why would you pay full retail for a fragrance like this when... Uh, there's a million out there that do pleasant mainstream like this. Um, I don't really have much more to say on this. Sampling samples is going to tell you guys way more on this particular fragrance to see what I get in the dry down. That's where either this is going to fail or it's going really going to kind of stand out. But right now this opening is your usual. This sample keeps falling off. Yeah, that's this opening. Yeah, man. Uh, it reminds me, uh, this opening, I gotta take a look at the note breakdown, but this opening, it's starting to delve into something else, but um, I've smelt it before, not just the grapefruit, but this blend. Uh, one of my cheapies, and I'm trying to think here. God damn. <sighs> what does it smell like? Damn it. Okay, well, anyway, um, I'm sure I'll probably get in sampling samples, but this initial impression on Mr. Burberry, not good. Um, so if you are watching this and uh, you have the same taste as me, um, you own multiple bottles, you're looking for something different in the designer game, Mr. Burberry uh, to me right now is a flop. Um, grapefruit, 
opening are really cheap. Uh, bottle's beautiful, um, but really this is not giving me much hope. So this one, I know that a lot of you have smelt. A lot of you have owned it, uh, own it, love it, hate it. Um, I love the comment section of blow up on Mr. Burberry here on this initial impression. You guys tell me in the bottom here in the comments. Do you feel the same way as I do? Is my initial impression, am I off here or what? Um, it really is very watery, uplifting. Um, it really just is a summer type scent, but at the same time, not unique. Um, smells like a million other fragrances. It's not standing out. And in a beautiful bottle like that, um, this is almost a waste for somebody that has a collection like mine. Um, I really feel like this is going to get lost in the sea of fragrances, and it's going to hit discounters pretty quick if it hasn't already. Shame. Shame, shame, shame.